morning ladies and gentlemen Connor your YouTube fisherman back again fishing yes I know it's been a while it's been three weeks I haven't fished I've been under the weather but thank God I'm okay so I'm back doing what I love and today I'm gonna take it easy actually I was gonna take my kayak but it's too much effort I still don't feel that well so I just want to chill, fish, catch what I can. We're right here at the Port Jetty. I'm just gonna take it easy and try to catch some maybe redfish, snook, swimming by, flounder, sheepshead, black drum, whatever bites. All right, guys, we're gonna use our frozen mullet for some any snook redfish. They like the cut mullet as well. Just like that, little split shot, there's no current. So I'm gonna throw that there with the 4000 Shimano uh, Sienna. And then of course for jetties, piers, anything, I'm gonna use my two ounce spoon. I have a smaller one there as well, right there. Nice gold shiny color with some feather. You're gonna use that, do some jigging for Spanish mackerel, jacks anything on the surface bluefish and of course i'm gonna try my gut shoulder too i see some you know movements on top so that's what we're gonna do and so we're gonna work the bottom with that top with the spoon and uh all the artificials and see what we get let's go oh we got a bite Oh, that was good. We got a good bite. Took the bait from all the way to there. Man. Okay, okay. Some action on the frozen mullet. Oh, yeah. He almost came out. Look at that. Let's put it back right in there. There we go. Let's go. Come on, Jetty, produce for me. Here, guys, at the Port Jetty, it's hit or miss. Unfortunately, that's how it goes here, especially the summer times, but I only got power to just come over here, relax, <laughs> throw my rod out, hope for the best. All right, guys, a little midday update. It's been crazy slow couple bites but that's about it it's a very very hot day but we got our frozen mullet on a carolina rig and we got our shrimp frozen shrimp i jigged man i jigged everything and absolutely nothing tap tap little rock fish all around there on the rocks but that's about it so hoping to get lucky for some redfish snook black drum passing by that's how it goes at port jetty oh fish on i was about to leave on a shrimp what do we got oh looks like we're not gonna get skunk <laughs> hopefully we got something <sighs> i was about to leave man that's hilarious Yep. Little Margate. Oh man. Hey, whatever it is, I'll take it. Didn't get skunk. Throw it back out there. First fish of the day. <laughs> I couldn't leave you guys without a good fish, man. So I am back. Two days later, I'm feeling so much better, thank God. There's nothing like health, guys, so I feel so much better, but I'm here. So that's why I decided to do surf fishing. I don't feel 100% to take my kayak out. That's a lot of energy, requires a lot of energy. 
I couldn't do that and I have limited time. I gotta pick up the girls, you know, school is back on. Gotta pick up the girls. But I'm here, Plyle in the beach. Beautiful day. Winds around three to four miles east, northeast. Not my favorite, my favorite west and north. But I'll take east, east, north, northeast. That's my third, second best, so. No seaweeds. We're using our uh, pompano rig. I got my frozen shrimp from my buddy Kaihan. I have the previous video. I'm gonna link it here. You can watch it. He has a secret bait. You should need to check that out. So I have that on that frozen shrimp. And I got another one right here for the sand fleas and fish gums. That's the orange blaze. Number three ounce. Primit way should hold fine. And I do have some uh, frozen mullet too, cut mullet. So I'm gonna go ahead and use that with the Carolina rig and wire lead. So any bluefish, Spanish mackerel, shark, they don't have to break me off, you know? Hopefully we'll catch them. But today, I just wanna keep some fish. I emptied the freezer, it's been a while, so now it's time to keep some fish. Good size whiting, hopefully, golden nugget, pompano, keeper pompano, and whatever bites, whatever else bites. So have a limited time, hopefully we'll catch something, and I'll give you guys a good video. Let's go. First fish of the day is a whiting. Look at that, that's a good size too. Okay, we want to get a keeper whiting and we got our keeper whiting. Oh, I love this. Good morning, everybody. Oh, baby. I'm back, baby. <laughs> that's a good size, nice chunky. Not too big, not too small. I'll take it, man. Whiting is whiting. He bit on the sand fleas, frozen sand fleas. Get some fish tacos tonight. Oh, another good bite. Put it on. Come on, be on. Yup, it's on. It is on. What do we got? Whiting, small whiting. Ah, little pump. Baby pump. Hey, that's a good sign. Where there are babies, there are mom and pop. Again, sand flea and fish gum, orange blaze, little baby pump. Thanks for coming, buddy. Send me your mama, papa. Fish on, baby. Fish on. Yes, it's before 12 o'clock. It's been slow. One whiting, one small pump. Come on, baby. It's swimming this way. What do we got? Small pump? Yep. Looks like it. Oh man. Oh man. Okay. Well, pompanos are running. My neighbor over there, he caught a good keeper size, I believe. Oh, I think I have fish on that one too. This one's a little bigger. Sand flea and fish bites. There you go. Little pump. See you later, buddy. I'll see you in a couple months when you get big. Well, guys, that's the time I had. Gotta go pick up the girls from school. It's almost 12 30, 1 o'clock. But that's it. Two pompanos, not a keeper, one whiting, couple bites, but not much. 
And like I said, I use frozen uh, mullet, frozen sand fleas, frozen shrimp, and not much, man. It's hot. The brief description of summer fishing, it's just slow and hot. It's ridiculous out there. You have to be here early, early if you want to catch some fish because the water gets around 85 degrees. It's ridiculous. But uh, my neighbor, uh, he was like 100 yards uh, off right of me. He used live sand fleas and he caught one keeper pompano, a couple whitings and one huge permit. It was at least 20 inches. So definitely live sand fleas are the tickets. Next time I'm definitely gonna get some. But that's it guys, you know, that's all the energy I had for beach fishing. I could cast it out, but I'm out of bread. I'm just getting back to normal. So I'm definitely gonna be doing a kayak fishing. Definitely gonna go, I have an excellent spot for tarpon, snook, redfish, it's incredible. And I have to catch my own bait, live bait, for, uh, mullet, live mullet, whatever I can get and try to catch some for you guys um, nice tarpon man hopefully that's coming up next i will see you guys on the next video thanks for tuning in it's so good to be back i know not too much action but i've been away for at least three weeks now so it's so nice to be back i'm really glad i am back so i'll be making more videos for you guys please tune in hit the subscribe button hit that like button my goal is 2,000 subscribers by the end of the year, so please help me out, hit that subscribe button. I will see you on the next video with lots of fish. See you guys.